Okay, so this is my little Tahiti Fashion Week video. And um, Tahiti Fashion Week is tonight and I've been nervous all week. In fact, for the past two weeks and today I'm not nervous at all, which is weird. Um, but yeah, I'm just about to iron everything and make sure that I've got everything that I need. And in about three hours, I'm meeting up with Tive, who's my friend who's also doing the Fashion Week. She has a swimwear brand, so hopefully we'll calm each other down <laughs> later on. So this is my Tahiti Fashion Week collection. I've got pants, different prints. Then I've got a few dresses, some skirts and some short skirts. So I'm just gonna iron all this, make sure that everything is fine. Nothing's got stains on it, nothing's got pulls. And yeah, just make sure that I've got everything that I need. So once I've done all that, we're going to head off to the event, which is at the Intercontinental Tahiti Resort, which is really, really nice. I don't think I'm going to be able to film backstage, but I've got my friend Kim coming along and she's a pro at videos, so she's going to video a bit for me. And hopefully I'll be able to add some of those clips into this. I'll try and take you along on as much as I can. <laughs> It was so good, I'm so happy. Uh, it all went really well. The girls looked so nice and they were all so nice backstage. Turns out I could film backstage, but I was told that we couldn't, so I didn't take my camera. So hopefully my little iPhone clips will, will do. I was nervous and I didn't sit down the whole time before it was my, my turn to go on. So there was like 16 girls, two groups of 16 girls. The first group would go and catwalk with, do the catwalk with one brand and then they'd come backstage, get changed into another brand and then the other group would go out whilst they were getting changed and we only had eight minutes to get them changed so the whole time I was like, oh my god, eight minutes, like I'm not, not gonna have time and the tops that I had made were quite fiddly and the ladies who were helping me dress the models like I was trying to explain it to them and stuff but I was like oh no they're not going to be able to do it properly but yeah I didn't expect it to go so smoothly and it did luckily so and the girls just yeah they looked really nice and they were all stunning I never thought that I'd be able to do the fashion week I set up my brand two years ago it's only a small brand there's only me I started off with a sewing machine Ryan bought me my partner bought me a sewing machine just for as a hobby really and then I started making clothes for friends and then it got onto, you know, I made an Instagram page and yeah, it just, it just grew from there and I didn't expect to do the fashion week, never mind be asked to do the fashion week. It was amazing and I want to do it all over again now, <laughs> even though I didn't want to do it at all um, last week. After all that stress, <laughs> it was over in like six minutes of catwalk. Yeah, I got really good feedback and yeah, I'm just really happy. I'm very proud of last night and I'm very proud of my brand and the fact that I even dared to do the fashion week. I just wanted to thank a few people. I want to thank 
Agnes and Alberto for encouraging me to do the fashion week. I don't think I'd have dared without them. They organized it all. It was an amazing event, really professional. They were so nice backstage, made everybody feel comfortable. And yeah, I wanted to thank them for always encouraging brands to put themselves out there and to push the limits. I'd like to thank Ryan and all his family for coming and supporting me. It was really nice to have them in the crowd. Thank Kim for coming and filming for me and she helped me out backstage. TV, TV has a swimwear brand called T Waves Tahiti. Check her out on Instagram. She set up her brand at the same time as me. She makes everything herself just like I do. And we had a bit of a pact that if one of us did it, then the other person had to do it too. I would also like to thank Hini Magazine, which is a magazine here in Tahiti and They've got my stuff a couple of times um, from the shop where I sell my clothes and they've taken photos and put them in the magazine and you know it just helped, it's all advertisement so and they were there last night they put a long story up of the whole catwalk which I'll insert into this video I'd like to thank Mathilde who has a brand called Kahakai she partnered up with me to do the catwalk show, she did all the hats and the bags which were really nice and it all just looked really nice and I'm just really happy and yeah thank you everyone thank you if you watched this video till the end and yeah see you next year maybe Il y a trop de boobs là-bas. Il y a trop de boobs. Il y en a vite, c'est des boobs.